Hey, what's going on, guys? Uh, I wanted to make a video. A lot of guys you know, in the gym, and you know, ask me about diets, what they should, what they should be eating. And I'm no professional. I'm still learning, but uh, figured I'd make a video showing them the things I did learn. So me and the Zoe Monster will take you through some of the stuff you'll find in a fighter's fridge. <clears throat> I guess we'll start right here. Uh, got some bananas. Potassium right there, baby. Eat a banana a day. I usually keep lots of fruit in the house. There's some stuff I'm missing today because I do need to go shopping. But uh, I like oranges. Apples are like fiber bombs. Pears too are good. Uh, apricots. Um, yeah. So uh, let's head up here. Um, usually, uh, here we'll go right here. Usually soups are pretty high in, in sodium, most of them. But I like the healthy choice. It's not that bad. Uh, and plus, uh, if you go to Sam's Club, and by the way, everyone should get a Sam's Club membership. It's insane. I mean, you could get 10 of these for like 450. That's less than 50 cents a can. So, if you go to a uh, shop, right, they're like two bucks each if you're lucky. Um, sea salt. I guess sea salt rocks. Uh, it's pretty much the same thing as regular salt, only it's more natural. It's, it comes from uh, uh, like evaporation. They evaporate it for uh, seawater. You know what I mean? So. Uh, I like organic foods, and it just feels feels right eating the sea salt. Get yourself a little grinder, and I put sea salt on everything. Um, I like to eat uh, a lot of um, peanut butter and jellies. Get the organic jelly. I have that in the fridge. Uh, Skippy, I actually really like the natural. It's pretty good, so that's not bad. Uh, got some honey here. I put honey on everything, especially my... Uh, my um, yogurt, because I have a uh, plain yogurt, uh, natural, I mean, uh, organic uh, tomato sauce. Ronzini, there you go. Ronzini is the best pasta on the market. The, uh, the Healthy Harvest, the whole grain pasta, it's the best whole grain pasta on the market. Lots of fiber, and it tastes awesome. A lot of them have a strange texture, stuff like that. Got the coconut milk. Uh, what else we got in here? Uh, that's pretty much it. If you're gonna, if you're gonna get um any canned fruit, because I think I have some in here, somewhere hidden amongst the uh, nonsense. But if you're gonna get canned fruit, try to get um yeah, no syrup, not light syrup even. Try to get it in juice or in uh, pear juice. A lot of stuff's put in pear juice. So uh, yeah, the syrup's real sugary. It's pretty nasty. Let's head up to the snack area here. Uh, 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 okay, this is probably number one thing in my kitchen. Craisins, it's uh, packed with antioxidants, uh, tastes great on everything. Yeah, I throw them on my salad, throw them in my yogurt. Craisins are awesome. Yeah, I love them. Uh, got more, some kashi crackers here. I actually really, really, really like some of the kashi stuff, but it can be expensive. But if uh, you go to the Kashi website and uh, sign up to be a member, yeah, that's right, Zohan. If you sign up to be a member, uh, you get coupons and stuff, and it's actually not so bad. Uh, okay, these. Oops. Are uh, one of my favorite, like, up and coming companies. Well, not really up and coming, but I'm starting to get into them. Uh, it's uh, Sage Valley, and uh, they do a lot of organic stuff, and um, they're actually really cheap. Like these, uh, this bag of um, tortilla chips is actually a lot in there, and it's friggin' cheap. It's like a dollar fifty a bag. Same thing with the uh, cheddar puffs. I get these as a nice uh, cheat every now and then. I like the Pirates Booty usually, but the Sage Valley is just as good. Um, got uh, almonds back here. If you notice, a lot of this stuff is the uh, big wholesale size because I'd be rocking that Sam's Club membership these things are beyond delicious I hope you're wearing a uh, hat when you eat them because it's gonna blow your noodle honey graham sticks I think they sweeten them with uh, cane sugar I know they sweeten them with honey so they're really good they're awesome they're kind of expensive though you want more stinky did you eat all that already she loves her vegetables uh, if you're gonna eat a cereal, go with Kashi cereals. The heart to heart stuff is really good. I like the uh, island vanilla shredded wheat things, but they're pretty high in sugars. 
So, you stick with Kashi. Kashi has, uh, most of their stuff is really high in fiber. It's good stuff. Uh, I got probiotics chocolate up here. I eat one of those a day. It actually has three times the lifespan, the probiotics, and uh, the ones in yogurt, and uh, three times the content. So, it's pretty good stuff. Just got some oats here. I uh, put oats in my shakes. I make oatmeal cookies with uh, craisins. Uh, or I just make plain oatmeal with honey in the morning. Um, these are the old fashioned. They, you got to boil them or whatever. But you can eat the uh, instant ones. The quick oats. There's no difference really. They're just steam different in the uh, factory where they're made. But uh, don't get uh, put off by the quick, quick oats. It's not like the instant <laughs> ones with maple syrup and uh, apple sugar bombs that'll give you a headache for a year. That's, uh, it's different stuff. So, quick oats, it's actually okay to, to deal with. Uh, some balsamic and basil vinaigrette with, uh, extra virgin olive oil. And then I got some extra virgin olive oil down there. Put that, I use that to bake my chicken, usually. I'll bake a tray chicken, put, like, crushed garlic on it. Stuff like that. Got the whey protein up here. That's a uh, pro complex from ON, Optimum Nutrition. They make the best uh, bang for your buck, pretty much, protein. They use the amino acids, uh, has casein and whey, which is uh, casein's a slower dissolving. Got the hint of salt Triscuit crackers, and it'll uh, pretty damn good. All right, what we got in here? We got the um, bars. I usually throw those in with my lunch for work and stuff. Like I said, all the Kashi stuff is pretty good. We got a uh, you know, decent um, protein, fiber, and uh, whole grains in it. Nana is her word for food, by the way, because the first thing I ever fed her was a banana, so that's why she's screaming Nana's in the background. She's not like uh, seeing someone die in the yard, like her grandmother or something. Uh, organic green tea. I make a lot of green tea. Here we go. Ugh. There you go. Flax. Flax seeds. It's ground. Get it at Sam's Club really cheap. And put it on everything. It's 2,800... Uh, Milligrams of uh, omega 3s. It's like the second best source of uh, omega 3 you can get. Uh, of course, there's a little fiber and protein in there. It's good stuff. Put it in your shakes. I throw it on my yogurt. I throw it in my uh, oatmeal. Good stuff. All right, let's hop in here real quick. Uh, I got my pitcher of green tea. I make a pitcher, drink that all week. Um, got strawberries back there. Most berries are good for you. Uh, blueberries are awesome, uh, raspberries, blackberries are real good, and you throw those all on your salads. Cherry tomatoes, pretty good for you. Rotisserie chicken, and when I'm not baking a chicken, I get rotisserie chickens. To They're not as healthy really, but you know, they're, they're still good, and uh, it satisfies that primal need to tear at a carcass. It's coming, little lady. Uh, baby carrots, there's uh, Zoe's vegetables I gotta give her. Organic, um, not organic, I'm sorry, yeah, but uh, it's sweetened with fruit, so it's a jelly. I make a lot of um, peanut butter and jelly. It's got some sliced mangoes here. Don't have much fruit rocking in the house, but <sighs> the mangoes and the bananas, yeah, like I said, oranges are good. Pineapple, here we go. That's the pineapple I was looking for in its own juice, not in syrup. Salsa. Salsa's great. There's like a... A serving in like a serving of vegetables and like a speck of this. Eat lots of salsa. If you if you have a grilled cheese maker or something, put a, get the Martin's potato bread. Put a little salsa. I don't really like this kind, but it was on sale at uh, Sam's Club. Put a little salsa and uh, some um, mozzarella cheese, fresh mozzarella cheese, and uh, that'll that'll cave your mind in with goodness. All right. Got uh, for my salads. Got. Baby spinach, organic, uh, organic um, romaine lettuce, don't eat iceberg, try to go organic too if you can, but don't eat iceberg, get the uh, romaine hearts, uh, the cake is my little girl's, not mine, I'm not eating it, don't worry, a lot of people are worried about me, um, okay, if you're going to listen to me about one thing, let it be about Martin's whole wheat potato bread, the best thing on the planet, has four grams of fiber per slice, 16 grams of uh, whole grain, and it tastes delicious. So there you go. If you guys have any questions, I'll uh, try to answer them as best I can. Take it easy, guys.